hello to all my friends and welcome to Early on Explorers. With me, Miss Amanda. Thank you so much for joining me today. I have my two little helpers, Ella and Emerson, with me, and today we're going to go searching for some rocks. Do you want to know why we're going searching for rocks today, Ella and Emerson? Yes. No. Yes. Yeah? We're going to go searching for rocks so that we can paint them. Yay. So this first segment, Miss Amanda and Ella and Emerson, we're going to go for a walk and find some rocks. And then when we're done, we're going to come back and we're going to set up and paint our rocks. Does that sound like fun today? Yes. Awesome. Okay, so we're going to start and we're going to go looking for some rocks. All right, you make sure to tell me if you see a rock. We found a rock. Where'd you find a rock? Right there. Right here. Okay, so I'm going to pick up this rock and I'm going to hand it over here. And we're going to keep going. Okay. I found one. How many rocks do we need? Ella three. and Emerson? Three. 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 That one. Oh, here's another rock. This is a big rock. I can wow. open this one here. Miss Amanda's going to carry this one. It's a little bit heavy. We're, maybe I'll switch with Emerson. Here we go. Got that big bug? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. All right. We're going to keep walking. And we're going to find another rock. Emerson, stay back. Oh, I spotted one right here. There. All right, everyone. We have one, two, and Emerson has a rock, three rocks. We're going to walk back home, and we're going to get set up to paint. So Miss Amanda encourages you to go for a walk, find a beautiful rock that you want to paint, and bring it home. We'll see you soon. Welcome back, everybody. As you can see here, Miss Amanda made a beautiful setup to paint rocks with Ellen Emerson. I set up outdoors because Early On Explorers is all about being outside and enjoying nature. So you never know what kind of wonderful sounds or beautiful things that we're going to see outside. So as you can see, Miss Amanda set up three spots here with Ella's rock, Emerson's rock, and Miss Amanda's rock. And I laid us out all some paint. I have a bunch of paintbrushes here, and we're going to get started painting our rocks. However, before we begin, I suggest just quickly rinsing your rocks under some water to give them a quick little clean. That way they're nice and ready for you to paint. So we're going to get painted on our rocks and we will see you soon explorers to show you what we came up with. Hi explorers, I'm just checking in. We have been painting our rocks for about 10 minutes now. So I just wanted to give you a quick peek on what we've done so far. So here we have Miss Amanda's rock. It's taking me a bit of time. I painted mine black for now. I'm just letting it dry off so I can flip it over and paint the other side. And over here we have Mr. Emerson's rock that he finished painting. No, don't do that side, do that side. I'm gonna show them every side, buddy. So this is what my little buddy Emerson drew or painted on his rock. And here we have Miss Ella, and she's still working on hers. But this is her beautiful rock that she's working on. I can't wait to see what my explorer friends do with their rocks. Okay, everyone, that's it for the check-in. We will see you soon with our completed projects. Welcome back, explorers. Ella, Emerson, and I have finished painting our rock, so I just wanted to show you the final product. So I'm just going to get Ella to point down here with the camera to show you the rocks. So I'm going to start over here with Ella's. Ella painted her beautiful rock on both sides. And as you can notice, boys and girls, this side has something white on top. And that white stuff is called Mod Podge, which I have right here. Now you can purchase Mod Podge anywhere, in Walmart, Michaels, anywhere, and for this size of bottle it's about $20. But Miss Amanda recommends Mod Podge, that way it keeps the paint on and it'll stay on the rock and it won't chip off in the weather. Here we have Emerson's nice rock that he painted and you can see the Mod Podge on it still drying. He finished quickly before Ella and I, so here's Emerson's final product. And Miss Amanda's rock. This is my rock. And I wanted to write a nice message on my rock. So I painted some stars on here and I wrote, reach for the stars. 
Always reach for the stars and go for what you want. You can do anything. So thank you everyone for joining me today for Early On Explorers and I can't wait to see if you've painted some rocks at home as well. Take care everyone and we will see you next week. Bye bye!